the challenges and potential impacts of El Nino on Lake Mead. Welcome to today's discussion on Lake Mead, the largest reservoir in the United States, and the ongoing challenges it faces due to drought. In this video, we will explore the current state of Lake Mead, the historic agreement to reduce water usage, and the potential effects of El Nino on the water levels of the lake. Lake Mead and Hoover Dam Lake Mead, located behind the impressive Hoover Dam, is a vital water source and power generator. The dam, built during the Great Depression, stands at an impressive height of 726.4 feet and spans the Black Canyon between Nevada and Arizona. It serves as a crucial water source for cities in the Southwest, including Las Vegas and Los Angeles. Declining water levels and drought extended periods of drought and increasing demand have led to a significant decline in the water levels of Lake Mead. Currently, the water level is 1,054.53 feet above sea level, which is still 174.47 feet below its full pool capacity. Despite recent snowpack in the Rocky Mountains, the long-term outlook for Lake Mead remains uncertain due to ongoing drought conditions. Historic agreement to reduce water usage after intense negotiations, California, Nevada, and Arizona have reached a historic agreement to reduce water usage from the overdraft Colorado River. The agreement involves giving up 3 million acre-feet of river water through 2026, approximately 13% of the current allocation. In exchange, farmers and other water users will receive $1.2 billion in compensation from the federal government. Challenges and long-term conservation measures while the agreement represents a significant step towards addressing the water supply crisis. Experts emphasize the need for more significant and long-term water conservation measures. The current agreement saves approximately 1 million acre-feet per year, but experts suggest conserving at least twice that amount to ensure the sustainability of the water supply. Potential effects of El Nino on Lake Mead El Nino a climate pattern occurring as part of the El Nino Southern Oscillation. ENSO cycle brings wetter weather to the southwestern region, which could positively impact Lake Mead's water levels. During El Nino, trade winds weaken, causing warm water to move eastward towards the west coast of the Americas. This increased rainfall and snowpack can help replenish the lake's water levels, providing relief to the water-stressed region. Implications and precautions While the potential arrival of El Nino is seen as positive news for the water levels of Lake Mead, there are concerns about associated risks, such as flooding and mudslides. Regions must be prepared and effectively manage their resources and infrastructure to mitigate these risks. It is crucial for affected communities to take necessary precautions and ensure ongoing recovery efforts from previous flooding incidents. Lake Mead continues to face significant challenges due to drought, but the recent historic agreement and the potential impacts of El Nino offer hope for improved water levels. It is essential to remain vigilant, implement long-term conservation measures, and be prepared for the potential risks associated with climate patterns like El Nino. Thank you for watching, and remember to subscribe to our channel for more insightful content.